Welcome. I am the Fitness Sorcerer. In this video, we're going to be doing some body weight squats. These are great for warming up. So if your muscles are cold and you feel like you need to warm up before a workout, it's a great exercise. Also, if you don't have equipment, if you don't have a squat rack like I do or a power cage, um, it's just a great way to work your quads and your glutes. So I have a bench here behind me, which I'm going to use. And how I'm going to do these, and there's many ways to do these, is I'm going to stick my arms out, my chest out, and I'm going to squat until I hit the bench. Okay, and I'm gonna do 10 reps, take a break, and repeat. All right, so let's begin nice and slow, and I'm gonna pause a little bit at the bottom just to make sure that my butt touches the bench. Okay, so here we go. It's great for working on your squat form as well. <sighs> Breathe out on the way up. Two, four, five, six, seven, eight, so that was 10. Take a little break there. Just a nice way to warm up and loosen up the muscles before a heavy workout or as a substitute uh, for a heavy workout uh, if you don't have, uh, if you don't have um, you know, the right equipment. All right, let's go ahead and do another set of 10 here. more. I'm going to move my bench out just a little bit because my mat has, there we go, my mat has a little bit of a, of a crease there. And so by moving the bench out a little bit, my feet are flat. So you can stretch between uh, sets. I'm going to stretch my legs a little bit here just to loosen up before I do some heavy lifting. So I'm doing these today. Uh, it's a rainy day. Hopefully uh, the rain is not a distraction, but it's really, really cloudy and miserable out there today. So I thought, you know, it's time to, uh, to get to work. Maybe turn this rainy day into a bright sunny day. I think my shirt even says it, right? Sunshine and good days. That's what we need. We need more of that. And we got to turn rainy days into bright days. And one way of doing that is through physical fitness. All right, let's do another set here. We'll do 10 more. That was 10 more and already I can tell that was my third set. Already I'm starting to loosen up. I feel like that third set was much easier for me than the previous two sets. Now I'm gonna stretch the hip flexors. I'm gonna do that by putting one foot forward, arms up and just, ah, oh, yeah. Yeah, just feel it there. Just stretch out those muscles. There's all kinds of stretches you can do. I'll try to make some stretching content here on the Fitness Sorcerer um, so you can stretch with me. Stretching is important. It's one of the things that I personally have a hard time with. It's probably my biggest weakness. I can lift weights all day long. Um, it's the stretching that really, really holds me back. Do a little bit more stretching here. Went surfing yesterday and my muscles are just a little bit tight. You know, I train every day. By train, I mean I do something every day, either weightlifting, surfing, or running. I wanted to go for a run today, but I don't have waterproof running shoes yet. And I don't know if I feel like going to the gym. So I could do that. I could go to the gym. <clears throat> oh, that feels good. That felt good. It's just my left leg is a little bit tight there. All right, another set.
I wasn't even counting. I think that's 10. I'll count it as 10. Wow. What a stretch. Really feeling it. Really starting to feel myself loosen up here. Oh, stretch those hamstrings. Oh, yeah, it's loosen up. Great warm-up exercise. So far I've done, I believe, four sets of 10. Do a couple more sets. Get really warmed up here with these body weight squats. Stretch a little bit more. Nice stretch. I like this stretch. It really stretches your quads and I think it's called the solenus. I forgot what it's called. It's just the letter S. It's the front part of your leg. Um, it's a really small muscle that can sometimes get overused. People get shin splits and stuff when they run too much, uh, too soon. Mm, yeah, really loosen up those quads, loosen up those legs before we move on to heavy squats here. So, whew. all right. Let's just keep loosening it up. Yeah, that feels good. That feels good. Nice stretch. Nice stretch here. Ah, oh, feels really good. As much as I don't like stretching, whenever I do it, you know, I feel a lot better. So I know it's something I should do. Oh yeah, yeah, it really needed to be stretched. Pretty intense surfing session. I'm surfing again tomorrow. And the waves are supposed to be even bigger, so probably should do more stretching today. All right, one more set here of body weight squats. That's 10. That's 10 sets or five sets of 10. I think it's going to be it for me with the body weight squats. I feel like I need to warm up a little bit more. Maybe start with some light sets of squats. Um, a little bit more, do some jumping jacks or something. But that's the idea of body weight squats. You want to just use your body weight, warm up, don't overdo it. Um, if you're just starting, you know, always you know, talk to a doctor and stuff before you work out. But Body weight squats are a great exercise that anyone can do. You don't need any equipment. Uh, if you have a chair or a bench, it's good practice because it'll force you to go a little bit lower. Just, you can kind of, you're basically sitting on it. You're just sitting and standing, basically. That's all you're doing. Very basic movement. As always, be safe. All of this equipment, my entire home gym is, well, except some of the used vintage stuff. I got it on Amazon. There's a link in all of my fitness videos to all of my gear in case you want to check out what the fitness sorcerer uses. Um, yeah, stay strong. Keep working out.